living in Florida, we know what it's like to live through a tropical storm yeah. or to have tropical storm force winds. This has happened every year that we've been doing the show. And so we've had a show that has been somewhat similar to this. And when you have winds in the 30, 40, 50, 60, potentially higher range, we know how to take care of those homes. A better answer than I probably just gave as to not to focus on whether they have hurricane shutters and things like that, is that our homes are built with materials and renovated with materials to withstand hurricane force winds and things of that nature. You can't renovate and build homes in today's day and age in Jacksonville, unless that's those true. are rated. It's, it's, to, it's written into the code. It's written into yeah, the code. Correct. So I, that's probably a better answer. I was focusing more on the hurricane shutter part of the question. But anyway, so big picture is most of our residents are prepared for this. As a resident of Jacksonville, we are prepared for this. And doing the simple things is the most effective most of the time, mm -hmm. right? If the storm would progress and it would lead to a place where evacuations would be recommended, we would also support with that message and help residents know what to do and where to go. But I think it's it really comes down to two things when you're serving residents in this initial part of the support stage, which is remind them of the simple things that we can do to prevent bigger problems mm -hmm. and then be there be there to support them. Yep. And phone support before, during, and after is the most important thing. I will share with you, though, when there is a storm going on on Wednesday, as it hits in the afternoon and in the nighttime, we're not going to send contractors out in the face of danger when there's still a storm going on. So there may be limited things that we can do to solve the problem right there if a storm happens to knock a tree down or something along those lines, yeah. but we're there to support. And we're there to let them know that we're here. And as soon as we can have a contractor go out and it's safe to tarp the roof or to take care of those items, we're there. Our team is there. Our contractor base is there. Got it. 